Welcome to this conference on Machiavelli is the Prince. I'm just going to do a very, very quick introduction. Uh, of course, I'm not going to say anything on Machiavelli. I didn't want to do that, and I keep the promise, uh, especially not why it would be or it is. Or we might think it is important to keep working and studying on Machiavelli. We wouldn't do what we do. We wouldn't even be what we are if we didn't think it is extremely important and relevant, both for education and politics, I have to say, uh, to keep working on Machiavelli. Uh, just one word uh, on the uh, striking diversity uh, of approaches and methodologies, or in other words, the heterogeneity, as I have been told, uh, represented in this conference. Uh, of course, <clears throat> this is not by chance. It doesn't happen by chance. I strongly believe that there is not uh, one Machiavelli, and there is not especially the Machiavelli, let's say, of the Italian studies, of the history of political thought, or political theory. Uh, if there is, I strongly believe that if there is one author that uh, I would play against what I consider one of the worst calamity of contemporary higher education and even the research environment in which we work, namely the, inter the disciplinary boundaries, uh, this author is Machiavelli. So it doesn't happen by chance that there is such a heterogeneity or diversity represented in this conflict. And then, uh, really, the bulk of my very short presentation is to say thank you to all the people that helped uh, putting this conference together. Uh, and I shall name them. Uh, so in the first place, this conference was made possible by a generous, I would say a very generous, uh, support of Brunel University, uh, in particular through our Research and Innovation Fund Awards. Uh, then, of course, uh, I had to name uh, Justin Fisher, head of school, who is here, is going to give a brief introduction as well, after myself. Uh, and also I want to mention um, people that are not here today, but uh, contributed uh, in supporting this conference since its inception. In particular, Danny Nobus, Pro Vice Chancellor for Strategy, Development and External Relations. Uh, also, Teresa Waller, Director of the Research Support and Development. Uh, then, more in general, the, uh, that's not the person, of course, the Higher Education Academy, who partially supported and funded this event, uh, in particular by funding the multimedia project. I'm going to say a few words about that uh, in a minute. And also, of course, I want to mention the co funding of. Uh, the University of Urbino of Milan Bicocca uh, and uh, Rome Tor Vergata, uh, which arrives through uh, the co organizers of this conference, uh, Fabio Frosini, uh, where is Fabio? Yeah, I don't see him. Yeah, there, Vittorio Molfino and Tania Rispoli. Uh, thank you very much, all of you, for working on this. Uh, also, I want to mention a few persons very quickly Nikki Elliott, uh, Jane Alexander, Thomas Ryan. Uh, Garrett Jones, Terence Tiernan, who is there, and all the staff of the Media Center, uh, as well as our graduate students, Andrea Baldin, Jamie Pittman, and Nathaniel Boyd, uh, who all contributed to the organization, the practicalities of the organization of this conference. Now, a few words on the uh, multimedia project. Uh, I also prepare, yeah, it is here. Uh, you know I've been working on this for a while now and thank you once again to those of you who take part into the project by recording during the conference before and after the videos uh, that goes here on this uh, website which is now live finally. Uh, so again this project was funded by the Higher Education Academy uh, under their flexible learning thematic area. Uh, now, as I told you to many of you, I'm not a big fan of the new technologies when they are intended to substitute the old technologies, namely the reading of the book itself. And that's what I had in mind when I kind of strategically put together this project, uh, having in mind the centrality of the text, the idea of keeping the text of the prints at the center, and I was sure 
that the videos that I would have recorded with you, many of you, uh, would have contributed to this spirit, let's say. So thanks again for taking part in this project. Uh, also, the conference papers will be recorded. Terence is there with the camera uh, and will be um, integrated uh, in, the, in the website itself. Now, a very last word also on the proceedings of this conference uh, because organizing all this, uh, myself and the other co-organizer, we were able to secure a contract with a new, for a new series, a contract for a new series with Brill Academic Publisher, and the first volume of the series will be the proceeding of this conference. So thanks again for contributing with your paper to this.